You're about to be audited. Ah. What does it actually mean, though? Well, why don't we talk about the movie Office Space? Warning, spoilers coming, but then again, it did come out in 1999. Anyway, the three main characters attempt to steal a few thousand dollars over a long time by hacking their company's system. Instead, they accidentally steal hundreds of thousands of dollars straight away after they realized they had misplaced a decimal point. Needless to say, the fictional company had a big problem with who had authorized access to their systems. At another point, senior management tell the protagonist, Peter, that they're firing his friends before it happens. Let's be honest, that's poor policy and procedure and that company would never pass a system audit. The point of a system audit is to make sure everything is in order and evaluate your organization's IT infrastructure. Since modern companies are increasingly computerized, making sure your business could survive a cyber attack is a vital preventative measure. Cybercrime is a nightmare for business. It's straightforward. No company wants hackers rifling through their private data or stealing from them, like in office space. Bet you'd be surprised to know that in 2015, 80% of businesses were failing their compliance audits. That's a lot. So, if you're a business that operates on IT systems, you need to know about system audits and why they happen. You'll learn all about the different stages of the process and the downsides of not complying. So, if you think you could be subject to an audit, or you'd like to get your company's policies in order before that happens, this course will tell you everything you need to know.